All right, we're going to do something different on J from the D. So I love college football, man. I absolutely love college football. You know, if things were different, I would have took football more seriously. Maybe I could have went and do some college football, you know what I mean? But I didn't. You know, I quit football after my junior year, you know. I played basketball a little bit. It's just I wish I could have took sports more seriously. But I enjoyed the game. I watched college football, college basketball. Watched a little bit of baseball here and there. I watch a lot of shit like boxing, NFL, NBA. I watch it all, man. I really like watch it all. So we gonna take a look at the greatest college football moments like this decade or maybe even longer. So we wanna check this out, man. I in the video, like and subscribe. You know the deal, man. Let's check this out, man. Let's get it. J from D type of shit. I'm going to make a couple parts out of this. So let's get straight into it, man. If you hear that shaking thing, I keep on hitting the edge of the table. I don't know why I keep doing that. But anyway, man, let's get straight into it, bro. I think this Tennessee versus Georgia. Let's get it. That's crazy. I remember watching this live. <laughs> it's like three or four niggas in the back. They still didn't catch the shit. A good game. That was a good game. Look at me some cranberry juice. Know where it is. They weren't back. <laughs> they weren't back. Mike Jackson was so cold in college, bro. I remember watching that game live too. Miami has some underrated plays too, like that whole last couple years. <sighs> Niggas forget how good UCF was back in the day too. They should have been in that title discussion in the college football playoff, but they weren't. I ain't gonna lie, that game was boring to me. Shit, Tennessee wasn't on a shit. God, Lee, what the, what the fuck? What the hell's going on? What the hell? Hold on, bro. Hold on. This nigga, this nigga, like going round and round like a motherfucking Madden game. Hold on. Let's go. Let's take this shit back. Look at this nigga doing. Look at this shit. Boom, boom. That's nigga, you can't catch me. Mm, boom, boom. You can't tackle me, nigga. Get the fuck away from me. Get a, look at that. Shit. What the fuck? <laughs> the announcer was boring with that. I've gone crazy if I was an announcer. Put me on ESPN. Well, that's crazy. Three or four niggas can't even catch him. That's an announcer. Oh, yeah. Shit. JV. That's Clowney was nasty in college, bro. Shh. Hit the shit out of him. This nigga had still probably hurt. That's, that's nasty. I ain't gonna lie. When was the last time Vanderbilt was good, bro? When was the last time they were good? They should have moved, go to American Conference or something like that. When was the last time these niggas have been good? They have done shit. I kind of want, I kind of, I like the underdog story, story, so I hopefully they can do some shit one day. Because I can't remember any time since I've been alive. I've been, nigga, I'm 21 years old, so I was born in 2000. I never seen Vanderbilt that good, ever. If they were good, I probably was young as fuck and couldn't remember. 
Never seen those niggas good ever. I'm not even trying to hate on y'all. If y'all ever seen this video, I want y'all to be good. I want y'all to win an SEC championship in the next couple of years. But I haven't seen y'all doing anything. Illinois, baby. I remember this shit. They really came back from all that. <laughs> That was a beautiful Corbin comeback. The carry. Cuts it back the five, the Where's your Corbin was so underrated, bro. Jimmy Brown, pretty good too. Brown was decent. For the touchdown. Looking for the end zone, throwing. It's caught. Daniel Parker. Brandon Peters had his moments. How did he catch that shit? What the fuck? When last time Missouri was good at football, like really good. Mon in zone, caught Courtney Davis. Hey, Mon was underrated. Jump ball to the How do you catch that shit? Rogers, I think, made that catch, and there's a flag. How do you wow. catch that? It's Rodgers! The Aggies win the game of the that year! Game is How did LSU give her like 70 points? Hi. What a throw. He caught it too. I'm seeing this. Boykin was so good in college too, bro. I really thought he was going to be something in the NFL too. I'm not a big fan of Boykin, bro. For TCU. This nigga was like, be like beating niggas' asses on offense. Leonard Fournette was nasty too. Johnny Football, baby. I gone crazy. I was coached too. He was so good to watch. Howard leaps. He has it. Touchdown, Carolina. Back from the dead. From the pocket on third and six, flips it backwards. Barkley, Barkley was just hopping over niggas. What did you say before? When she was doing that shit in New York, though, for real. Shit. God damn. Hold on. Go back. Hold on, bro. See that catch one more time, bro. How the fuck did he catch that shit? What the fuck? Hey, I got a friend named AJ Lawson. He played for Iowa. He, uh, he played like defensive back. Hopefully, he be doing that this year, though, for real. Shit, he would beat this shit. Big ass. Happy New Year, Irish! I'm sure he get the 10 on the pop deposit. He did it. I ain't gonna lie, I want Texas to be Oklahoma every single year because Oklahoma fans are so annoying. And you guys know exactly what I'm talking about. Freaking Michael Fiala and Hunter Ferguson. I ain't gonna lie, I'll go with uh, Xavier on this one. I want Texas to win every single year. Fuck Oklahoma. No offense. It's just a fan thing. I don't like actually think fuck Oklahoma. Like, you know. It's like you always have that one fucking friend, a couple friends always be bragging about some team, bro. So you want them to lose. It's the same thing with the Cowboys, my family. I can't stand Cowboys fans. They're so annoying. They're going to be good every single year, but absolutely trash. Fix that defense, Oklahoma. Just like the Cowboys. Kicker. Rear, lobs it in the air. 
Greer was so underrated too, bro. He could throw the ball, bro. Where's he doing now? I thought he was going to be like a top 10 pick after this. West Virginia was never that good at it anymore. Shit. Man, y'all fly. That's a football play, bruh. I was so pissed about this game, too. Lamar Jackson played his ass off. All I quick had to do is stay in bounds, bro. He would have got the first down, bro. Guys, I hate those super teams in college football and basketball. Except if it's, if it's out of the box. The fuck you catch that? It's caught. It's caught in the touchdown. The Russians never been given the end zone double coverage. It is up for grabs. It might be. No, it's no. It's out of the end zone. He cut that shit. He's always at one time Alabama loses every single year to somebody, bro. At the six yard line, Anthony. He was nasty as fuck in college, too. Look at him. He's fast as fuck. Look at that. Fast as fuck. Everybody thought Josh Washington was going to be so incredible in the NFL team last year. He was good at his fucking college. Look at this stuff with Cam Newton. This was his highest moment, bro. Look at this shit. This nigga 6'6", 250. Look at this shit. God damn. CBS has the best announcers for college football, hands down. Shit, how you catch that shit? Like the safety's in the corners where you're paying attention for USC. <laughs> One more after this one. Notre Dame always would be losing close games, bro. What? Last one after this, and we won't have to pause it. Be hitting, be hitting the shit out of niggas on offense. Like I said, like I said. Like I said. We already know this one. All right, man. Stay tuned for our second part. Deuces.